Hello everybody and welcome back to another Minecraft Let's Play video. Uh, I'm Beetleboy1 and this is another video inside of Beetleboy's beautiful world. Um, this video is going to be a bit funny because basically I thought this morning I was going to record a video because I hadn't for like two weeks and I felt really bad and I looked at my YouTube channel to see where I was and stuff and I realised that the last video on this series I uploaded was 1 minute and 10 seconds long. Now I recorded a full 20 minute video, so I then deleted that 1 minute uh, 10 seconds video thinking, oops, I felt, and that's not good because it's the middle of the night and I'm really scared, but I think I'm more peaceful and I don't know why it keeps doing that, but that's slightly odd. But anyway, let's get back to the topic really quickly. Um, I'll just quickly switch, I think. I don't know why I'm... Oh, no, I am on easy. Okay, that makes it even more scary because it means there's googlies about. So, I'm on my on my best behaviour. A lot of monsters over there. Let's sneak back in. Oh, zombie on the roof. Never good. Oh, I think he spotted me. Let's run. Run away. Run away, beetle boy. But yeah, as I was saying, sorry, is... um. Yeah, I tried to re-upload it then, that video. And it was a 20-minute video, but for some reason it's only uploading as one minute so i'm hoping that by the time that video this video comes that video is up it's uh, episode 12 super code but if it isn't um i'm really really sorry i don't know what's going on i don't really know what to say but ah, that zombie definitely did follow me but oh well a bit of rotten flesh Oh, we didn't even decide to drop that. But yeah, in this video, we're going to be going down to my um, super secret lair. Now, if you don't, didn't watch... Okay. I'm going to assume, <laughs> to make it easier, that you have seen the last video. But if you haven't, please go and check it out. I will ensure that that video is uploaded then. But basically... Ooh, can you remember the passcode? That's a secret. So basically, in the last video, I built this super secret lock code room here. So, <laughs> as you just saw, the code is this. I can trust you with this code. I can trust you. And that opens my doors. And then here is my super secret safe house. So as I described in the last video, I wanted to basically create all along my world, um, in different places, basically safe houses. So one in my house, one maybe out in my little, where all my friends' houses are going to be, that sort of thing. And um, this is one. This is going to be a big one. So this one's going to have a place to the nether as well. Um, a little down here there is going to be a little um, like safe room. So if there's like a zombie apocalypse or something. And here's going to be a room where I can, so if I remember the password, I can't remember if, is this right? No. Um, is it this, this, and this? There we go. Down there, there's nothing down there at the moment, but that is where um, I'm going to have a, um, a, a room to store like all precious items and stuff. And then, as I said, here's going to be my nether room. So actually, I need to go quickly to the surface because I've got my materials after that scary zombie fight, but basically, um, that's what we're going to be doing this episode, so I'm praying that I can get that other video up and running, because it's going to be really annoying if I can't, um, but if I can't, then I'm really sorry, guys, uh, this is episode number 12 in that case, probably unlucky, because it's 13, that's why, but as you can see, I've also got only an iron sword today, and my diamond sword is in the chest, and that's because I'm hoping we will go to the nether, so that'd be quite exciting, um, but we will see. Um, we will see if we can get down to the nether or not. Um, if we have time, we certainly will. Because it'll be fun. But for the meantime, we'll go down here. And basically, I will show you. So, since the last video, if it's up. I know this is going to be a bit weird, guys. But since the, if the last video is up, I have um, done all this. Um, I've basically built this. Um, just because in the last video, we built a locker code. And I didn't want you to have to go through another one. But basically, the reason it goes down is because behind there, there's just loads of... Um, wedgestone and stuff in here. As you can see, there's the sea under here. But this is my nether room, and I built this um, in a video that then didn't work. Yeah, I've had lots of problems. So I built this. I've done this video before, and I built this, but it didn't. The video didn't record properly. But this is what I got for here. So I've used my smooth sandstone in there, and then down here I built this outside of the video anyway. But we'll start with this. We'll just go and quickly grab my obsidian here, and this is basically where it's going to go. So I believe it's like this, one, two, three here, down here, and then up here. And I need flint and steel, don't I? Yeah, I need a bit of flint and steel, so I'm going to have to go grab that, and I'll see you in just one sec. Alright guys, I'm back. I've got my flint and steel, and shall we light it? Ooh! Right, we've got that now, and um, we'll hopefully go to that at the end of the video. Quickly, I want to see if this is going to work. 
This is my idea. Um, to have basically lava flowing from the corners here. I'm hoping it will stretch along. If it doesn't, then it doesn't matter because I'll just get some more lava. But I wanted the effect of... Oh, I don't think that's going to stretch far enough. No. But actually, that doesn't matter. That looks quite cool. If I pop... Um, what have I got on me <laughs> that won't burn? Well, should I should try some of this polished uh, granite. If we pop that there, there and there, this might look quite cool. I don't know. Oh! My goodness, I nearly fell in the lava there. That would have been disastrous. I don't know, it does mean it's going to be quite dangerous, but I want to add some spookiness to this room. Um, we're probably going to have a door or something, or something here, because otherwise I'm probably going to fall in. But anyway, um, next stop, we're going to go down here. Woo! And as you can see, this is a huge long tunnel. And this is my safe room. And you can see here I've got my like hazard warning colours. I've got a crisscross pattern on the ceiling. So basically in here, I'm going to have my bed. Where's my bed? I made a bed. I could have sworn I made a bed. Anyway, I'll make a crafting table. Hmm, that's very weird. Right, I don't know what happened to that um, that bed there, but oh well. And I'll pop the crafting table here and I'll leave it because I might need a crafting table. And how do I make wool? Oh no, I didn't make a bed. That's why I got this wool. How do I make wool? I mean, how do I make a bed? There we go. And I want two because I want a double bed because I want to be nice and comfy. And I think we'll pop it here. And where's the other one? Here. There we go. That's quite nice. And I might do like a bedside table. Um, Can we do that now? I don't know, how do you make fences again? Like, let's try it. Um, I'm going to need a few more sticks. If I just do that. There we go. Um, is it like this? Um, wait, let me try this. Okay, one, two. One, two. Uh, let's go halves here, halves here. We've got the wooden here and here. Okay, that's a fence gate, so it's the other way around, I think. So these all go in the middle. Like this. Um, no, like this. Uh, crafting with Beetle Boy, ladies and gentlemen. Crafting with Beetle Boy. Oh, I get so confused between all the, like, <coughs> clicky things and stuff. And I only need three. I don't know why I made so many. And if I pop that here, I can get a bit of yellow carpet, I think. Um, actually, black carpet might be quite a bit nicer. Um, just because it's, like, a bit less... Wow. Right, I don't know. I don't like yellow wool in Minecraft. It sort of makes me feel a bit sick. But that looks quite cool. It sort of blends in quite nicely. I can even do some sort of checker pattern along here. But that's not what I'm here for at the moment. I've also got my emergency pumpkins, you know. I like to have have some pumpkins. So if I just sort of do a, like, a, I don't know, like, um, this, that's fine. I know I just need some pumpkins to stare at whilst I'm asleep. Um, and also, the last thing that's really important is I need a chest. And in this chest, I'm going to have a whole load of emergency supplies. So if I put that over here, this can be guarded by the pumpkins. Um, in here I'm going to have one more pumpkin, because you can never have too many pumpkins. I'm going to have an iron sword, an iron leggings and an iron chest plate. A couple of bits of spare iron, I think. Um, maybe a couple of sticks, a bow, some arrows. How about I do half of these and then half of those. Eleven arrows, that's alright. Um, I could even chuck in some flint and steel, but I won't for the moment. I could have some, like... Right, if I get half of this yellow wool for the moment, and I can use that as piling material, that's quite cool. And hopefully when I get slimes and get pistons, I can sort of make some sort of cool contraption. But at the moment, this is just a basic thing. Um, when we go to the nether, I'll get some glowstone and I'll make a bit of a chandelier as well. But at the moment, this is the necessity... The, sorry, the necessities. Um, it's quite good. And you can see, uh, how do I get it back up? All right, this is the secret. You go down here. Oh, there's a little cheeky block here that I didn't notice when I built this earlier. Let me just pop this here. Um, a huge tunnel of granite goes all the way down here, and I'm probably going to have a minecart down here eventually. I just did this really quickly. Um, and you can see this bit hasn't been built as well, so we need to do that. But then if you go up here, ta-da! It goes straight to the ocean in front of my house. So, I'll tell you what, I'll start with these steps here. And I'll just add some granite going along. And how are we going for time? We're about halfway through. That's alright. Um, I won't do it all. I'll do a lot of it out of the video, if we can just sort of extend up to these stairs, because I do want to quickly open to the nether, even if it's just for five minutes or something, really quickly. Um, that would be pretty cool, I think. Um, don't know about you, but I would really enjoy that. Uh, let's do this, 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 this. We might not have time to do the uh, ceiling as well. And I know it's sort of going like a thump thump as opposed to stairs, but that's why I'm hoping for a minecart system instead of 
Oh, it's going to be a bit dark. Let's pop a torch, a torch here. Because we're not going to do minecarts this episode, I'm afraid. I'm not that organised. <laughs> I'm not I'm not organised enough to sort that out as well. I see. One day, if I get a few more subscribers and this becomes a bit more in important, then, yeah, I will... I'll promise I'll be a bit more organised. So tell your friends, tell your family, I don't know, whoever watches Minecraft in your life, or plays Minecraft, sorry, in your life, tell them about me. And then you never know, I might I might get some uh, minecarts down here as a little prize, I don't know. Whether we can get the most subscribers onto my channel or something like that. Um, anyway, let's just... Okay, that's not going to work. Why did I do that? It's a bit silly of me. Um, okay, so let's destroy that and pop that there. I am running out of granite now, which was a bit annoying. I'm not going to be able to do all of this, but if I just do up to here, it should be enough. Right, there we go. Okay, I'll leave this for the moment. I have got ladders. Obviously, I'm going to have to replace it with the granite later, but I'll just pop that there. So my minecart will end something like here, and then I'll just step here and go up these ladders. Um, why did I skip one out? Okay, it's going to get dark here as well. Um... Can I stand on this ladder? Okay. Let's, um... Okay, for the moment we'll leave it like this. We'll just make sure there's a torch at the bottom, because no one's going to spawn halfway up a ladder, no googlies. But if we hop up here, you can see that above this trap door... Oh, I need to close the trap door. Oh, I'll do it later. <laughs> I'm always going to run out of breath. Above this trap door, you can see... Woo! And there's my house. So, if I'm invaded by a load of zombies, I can stay down there until it's safe, and then I can hop back up if I need to. But no one's going to find, like, an entrance down there, which means the only way to get in is to crack my super code, which is going to be hard, you know? Um, well, I hope, anyway. But now we're going to go to the nether, and the one annoying thing is now we're going to go all the way back down my lift. But we've got about six minutes left of the video, I think, so if I just hop down my little Ella Big Tour here, and I go down into this... Um, Place. And I tell you what, next video, um, we will work on this, and hopefully, I've got some, oh no, it's destroyed by wood, the lava. Ah, okay, I'm going to have to replace this wood with something, I don't know, but um, it's going to keep doing that, I think. But in the meantime, uh, next episode we will do that, before we go to the nether, and then we might go upstairs and start work on a kitchen, or a dining room, or um, a lounge. Um, disco room, I don't know, a pumpkin appreciation room, I don't really care, but we'll do something else, so we will be moving on, we might even go outside and build another, like a little shop or something, we will see, but this is definitely the end of an era, this episode here, and ooh, 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 this is nice, ooh, all the spooky music in my headphones have gone really weird, ooh, hello Mr Pigman, hello, hello, I'm not going to hit you because then you'll get cross with me. Um, it's quite dark, isn't it? Oh, there's some nether quartz there. Let's grab a bit of that. Can I reach that? Yes, I can. Oh, there we go. Um, right, let's... I guess we're going to go on a bit of a search for nether quartz because that means... If we can get... In, oh, there's glowstone there. How did I miss that? Um, why do I get up here? Because if we can get some nether quartz, then we can start... This is what I want to build my uh, super secret safe room. Um out of with my uh, with my super safe items in there so if I can get some nether quartz that would be most handy right how do I pile up here what have I got on me uh, not obsidian that would not be sensible that would take way too long I could use black wool and I could just burn it but it seems a waste of black wool actually no I'm not going to do that because it takes me so long to shear things that I didn't wouldn't have the energy um, Let's grab this up, and this is also awesome for XP, if you don't know. This, like, makes your XP level so ridiculously high. Oh, this is huge, right? I'm going to just sort of shift-click along here and pile a bit of the way back here. Um, if I hop up here, here we go. I can just hop into the roof a bit and grab this nether quartz up. Right, is that everything here? Right, it is. So now I've got to be really careful. So if I just... Okay, my pickaxe is going to run out, so I'm going to do this with my bare hands. But, um... Here we go. Let's cop down. This shouldn't take too long. It's just wool. And then what we can do is we can go out and explore, see if we can find some 
monsters or something. I want to see a ghast. That is my aim. I want to see. I want to see a proper big ghast. And I mean, I've seen a zombie pigman, but I don't. I know you only get blazes in like the uh, Nether fortresses, so I'm not expecting to see one of them. But uh, we'll see what we can find. Right. I'm a bit worried that my pickaxe is incredibly low right now. One day I want to like build a little house in the nether, move the nether portal there, but I think I'm going to need another pickaxe, which I don't have. Um, actually, I can make one though. Uh, if I make another crafting table, this would be a sensible choice. Um, I don't know, the nether is actually quite boring, isn't it? Like, there's not a whole lot to do here, aside from kill some things and gather some more resources. Which is why I want to build a little house down here. A little, it can be my holiday home, my home away from home. Which would be um, quite dandy. Like, right, let's go grab up this glowstone. And there seems to be a bit more nether quartz up there as well. So if we can dig a staircase up here. Here we go. Uh, let's grab this first. Take this. And I've got some lovely smells coming down from downstairs in my my house where I'm recording. Something, something nice is cooking. It's my birthday on... Uh, in two days time, so maybe they're cooking a cake or something, I don't know. Quite cool. Nice chocolate cake. Yeah, but um, wish me happy birthday please, wish me like, all fun times, and I nearly forgot to grab that glowstone there, which would have been a bit silly. Right, how do I get up here? Let's pop up here, and let's destroy this. It's quite a big, um, quite a big amount of glowstone actually, just lying here. I didn't realise it sort of formed like this sort of dangling from the ceiling and yeah it all forms into dust so I believe you use glowstone dust for well it's suddenly made it a bit darker here um for brewing as well and that is one of my aims to find a nether fortress and go brewing and if that's the case I will do I will put it in a video um find a nether fortress sorry get a blaze rod and then start brewing we're quite nice right is that just a little tunnel here cheeky little tunnel one, another good thing about the nether is, apart from any nether fortresses, you don't get like skeletons and, and stuff. So, even though it's quite dark, I'm, and I, I know it's going to make it hard for you guys to watch, but for me it's relatively safe. Which is pretty nice. I wonder how much nether quartz I've got. And I know you don't get much for your like, so, I don't know, four pieces of nether quartz, this stuff makes one block. So I know you don't get much for your um, digging, but you do get a lot of XP and this Axe is about to break, so hold on to that um, other one there. Worth making that. Right, I'm gonna sort of have to go up here now. Oh, and that's broken, right. Switch onto this brand new shiny one, and oh, I can already feel it's a lot sharp, it's a lot smoother. I'm liking this, I'm liking this movement going on, yeah. I like this pickaxe a lot. Right, let's grab all that up. And let's hop down somewhere else. Hello, Mr. Piggum. I went inside you then, that was a bit scary. I can see on your mind, Mr. Piggum. Oh look, they're having a little bit of a gossip over here. And all oh, there's fire and there's scary stuff here. Fire and let's put out some of this, eh? I'm cutting away the floor as well now. Right, there we go, right. Okay, I don't want to burn this um nether quartz. I think I just did. Um because this nether quartz is gonna be very useful. Um, to me, I have to say, I love nether quartz. It's like such a simple block, but you know, like, you know all the range at the moment, all like the style is like really minimalist and modern. Well, this just like fits in perfectly. It's like such a nice block, even though it's literally just white. Ow! That wasn't very nice, that panicked me. Made me feel a bit, ooh. All right, let's go down here, have a bit of this more, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and find like Nether proper, we're gonna try and actually find an Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I accidentally hit a uh, Dolby Pigman. That's not very good. Oh my goodness, I really didn't mean to do it. I should have probably should have been a lot more careful than that. And I got like three chasing after me. Oh, this is so scary. Oh, what do I do, guys? What do I do? Ah! Okay, keep calm. I can face these guys. I can face them. I should have my bow out ready, really. Ow. Ow. They're actually owning me, guys. They're actually owning me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I am never hitting a zombie pigment ever again. That was terrifying. Did I even get anything? I got two gold nuggets. Excellent. Thanks, zombie pigment. You really made that worthwhile for me. Um, 
Well, that was scary, I'm not gonna lie, but on that note, this is the end of the video here, so what I'm gonna do is, okay, right, um... Okay, so next video is gonna be a bit of an update video, so basically what we're gonna do is, in that video, we're going to... I'm gonna have hollowed out a huge room for my safe, um, in my super secret room, and, um, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna, we're gonna fill that with jests and stuff, and then I'm gonna show you, basically, oh, a mushroom here, I'll take that, thank you. Um, I'll then take you down to the, uh, uh, safe house for me, and which will be updated with, like, glowstone chandelier and stuff. Um, I'll show you that, and then what we can, will do is we will, um, hop back to the nether, for, try and find a nether fortress, and then the video after that we will, um, go and do some other stuff. So, the next few videos are going to be a bit interesting, but after that, we it'll be quite fun. Uh, we'll basically go and build the rest of my house, which will be awesome. So, um, until then guys, uh, thank you very much for watching, it's been a great pleasure, please like, comment and subscribe, I love you lots. Um,